over the past two years, you've had a lot of change and adaptation for that team. And what, what are the, some of the factors that you have helped that have helped you guys to start seeing more success with the platform when you're dealing with all that change? So I'm going to go back a little bit in, in history because this will help paint the picture. Um, I think there was an initial question around ITSM and what that looked like. Uh, so at the time, you know, let's go back four years. We had a team of three people, myself, an architect, and a developer. We didn't have any BAs. We didn't have any admins. Um, we rolled out ITSM in six months. Uh, it was a very aggressive <laughs> timeline, and we took ITSM mostly out of the box. Um, there were challenges in that alone. Uh, there were challenges in getting our business process set up and who owned that. There were ownership challenges. Um, you know, the catalog items that we were bringing on the platform were very basic catalog items uh, and very little iteration. You know, folks were not you know, really willing to see a bigger picture. So uh -huh. what what that meant was that we were doing these very large waterfall uh, releases where you're trying to attain perfection and, you know, really just not take things in smaller bites. So let's fast forward two years to the question about, you know, the past two years. So what we've changed, um, we've really gotten top-down alignment uh, throughout the organization on the platform. That is so incredibly critical to the success to have, you know, all of the stakeholders and all the groups marching in the same direction towards the same goal. Um, we've increased our staff, surprisingly. Yeah. Surprise, surprise. Uh, I have five team members on my team now. Um, you know, we have three developers, business analyst, and admin. Um, and then we, we contract with CASC. So we have a large contingent of contract workers that are helping us work through some of these, um, primary work streams for the organization. 